What's up guys? Same Yo. dudes, Gian. George. Different hats, different t-shirts, and a different pair of shoes to unbox. What's in here today, dude? I'm super hyped about these. Uh, if you listen to the Dropcast, I've probably said the words Nike React LMA87 more than any other term on the Dropcast. I got someone checking into that So these are the undercover React LMA87. Wow. Um, they debuted at Fashion Week last season, two seasons ago, I should say, because there's a new one for fall. Um, or spring coming out. Dude, these haven't even come out yet. No, they, they have not. Uh, the release date is unconfirmed, so just like Nick Young question mark meme on what they're actually <laughs> releasing. Flash that but... on the screen real quick. Right. What do we got here? Which colorways we got? So there's four in all. We got two right here. These are two of my favorites. Of course, there's also the uh, two other ones. There's like a pair that's got a black olive Ooh. and then another pair that's like got like this electric yellow on the midsole that it had a red sole initially and it's an ice blue sole now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So we should probably talk about how, obviously there's been some changes from what we saw on the runway to the production. What we see here right now. So these initially had like a burgundy sole right here um, that matched the eye stays. You know, I'm not mad at the Volt. It definitely pops more. I would have loved the, the burgundy. But this colorway, let's see, what does it say? It's the, um, they call it lakeside, lakeside slash electric, electric yellow. yellow. Okay. Okay. I like electric yellow. That's cool. And these are the light beige, chalk, and signal blues. I don't know. I kind of like these because these remind me of Superman. Yeah. You know? I definitely hear that. I'm like a chocolate Superman. Obviously, the big difference between Do these, these be bizarre, and the regular React Element 87s is this undercover stamp. But let's go ahead and take it one step deeper. Let's look at what we had before. So obviously the box for these, these come in like a Nike Lab black box and the regular React Element 87s come in orange Nike box. So off the rip, not that many differences here. You can compare this one and I'll hold on to this one. So off the rip, there's uh, not so many differences in terms of the shoes themselves. They're pretty much the same, but. But what, Gian? The. Where's the keys? The footbed, oh. first off. So. We had the cork in here before, We right? have the cork footbed on these, which I like. I mean, the Tom Sachs Mars Yard 2.0s, those have a cork footbed. You can also use the regular uh, foam, whatever, whatever material this is, but these also do not have the cork footbed. They have whatever material this is. Let's see. Swing. There we go. So right there, big difference. Um, a pe I feel like people weren't huge fans of the cork. Like I like it, but I can see I it, like it getting brittle over time. I feel like it makes it a little barefoot friendly, you know, with yeah, the cork. For it sure. makes it summer friendly. But I'm not mad at this either. And I like how they're color coordinated to uh, the shoes too. So. You gotta match your fitted hats. Right. Air Force Ones. And these come with extra laces. The GR Nike Reacts did not come with extra laces. Um, and then of course you have the undercover stamp on the side that really just brings it all home. Really low key too. I mean, no idea what the retail for the undercover versions are, but it's gonna be more than the $160 retail for these joints. So I don't know. Stay tuned. Stay tuned for that. We really don't know that much about these shoes, except we need every single pair. Yeah. What's and your favorite so far? Are you feeling the Superman joint? These are my t my top two picks. You know, I went to Nike NYHQ, shouts to Nike NYC hey. um, for these pairs and giving us a preview of every, I think there's four pairs that I saw that are upcoming. Um, everyone's going crazy for the black and olive ones, but I feel like if Those are super it, wearable, but these are the stunt. You exactly, know what I'm saying? That's these what are I'm the saying. stunt. Like people gotta just take some risks. If you're gonna get a fashion sneaker, get fashion with it. We already got the wearable ones. We don't need more wearable ones. We need the stunt. Yes, we need like stunt. super out there shoes. Fast. Because I mean, Ju Takahashi is an out there designer. So what's also interesting is that this is not a Gyakuso shoe. It's not a running shoe. It's not meant to be running in. Um, it's an undercover lifestyle branded Nike shoe. Which there haven't been that many of them. Yeah, I was there was say, like that's the different. like the what the jungle dunk. Oh man. Which was like super chunky. That that's was like a wintry like, boot, that was a right? So Jun Takahashi has not done that many lifestyle collaborations with Nike. This one definitely just 
flexes on the previous it just, ones. It just pops Takes flavor. it to a new level. Drip sauce. Drip sauce all, all over. over. Any final thoughts, George? How do you think uh, these compare to these joints? Well, like I said before, like these are kind of like the everyday stunt, you know right. what I mean? These are like the everyday, these are what you wear like if you want to go to the gym before or after work, you want to flex at work, you don't sure. have to change out of stuff. But if you're really going to come at somebody with a fit right. and you could put these together, then you got some drip on you. Yeah, shouts to anybody that can like rocks these and rocks these well. Because these are, you know, they're challenging for you to wear. That's my favorite part about them. But then again, I dress pretty crazy. But when so, you do it. Yeah. You got to commit. It makes it. You know what I'm saying? Commit to the fit. I think I'm really about this one. Yeah. Like the olive ones are tight. These are tight. But I actually really like these this Volt sole just because it, I'm team Volt and just pops off a lot more. Electric yellow, George. Electric yellow. This is like, you know, um, what's the Mountain Dew competitor? Mellow yellow. This is mellow this is yellow. yellow. And this not is full mellow Mountain yellow. Dew. Yeah. True facts. And, you know, you don't want to get hit by cars at night, so wear bright shoes. True story. That's what I tell people. That's Big it. Facts. Stay tuned for more news on the Undercover yes. React Element 87s as we find out more info, but that's how they compare to the shoes that are already out. Thanks for watching. React!